โอเคไอายุเซอร์สตี้ very much so I can't have they are f- What's that supposed to be? A ticket. For the laundry lift? Um, maybe. Yes. But it's not. <laughs> What did the gentleman? Druggle. Ju- not while well I. The bowl is big enough. Okay, let's part the two. Please don't. Some things are meant to be together, like peanut butter and jelly, a coin and a payphone, pimples and teenagers, pot holder and pot holder, or you and me. Oh, Harvey, you're so cute. A payphone. Fine. If only. Ah, uh, it's broken. Up. So many possible phone numbers. I'd rather not. You don't put things in there. I hope. I'd rather not. It's only suitable for. I'd rather not. Are you hungry? I don't. I. F- That's. I. W- What did the gentleman care? I don't need anything. Ed, my. Sp- Are you in? You should never play polo while. I don't like to beat the pot. This is something that an extremely bored child would do. I think Alfred liked to do that. That's fitting. A couple of patterns can't hurt. Gentlemen, care. Struggle, job. Not while I'm. Are you thirsty? Very much so. I can't have the drinks that the barkeeper mixes. However, they are 50% insecticide.
Would you like another drink? I've still got my glass. Barkeep, one drink, please. I'll be with you in a minute. I'm still serving this gentleman here. But he already has a drink. Don't tell me my job. A couple of patterns can't hurt. can't hurt. What's that supposed to be? A ticket. For the laundry lift? Um, maybe? Yes? But it's not. Hi there. Tickets, please. Who is in possession of a ticket, if you don't mind telling me? Huh. There are lots of tickets in circulation. Mr. Frock has one. He holds a season ticket, and he's our most frequent customer. Which means... He lives in the laundry lift. Professor Nock has another ticket, meaning the ones found on the ground floor. Alaman has the third ticket. I'm uh, considering withdrawing it. He doesn't use it according to the rules. Okay, and who else owns a ticket? You said there are many tickets circulating. Yes, uh, why? Uh, isn't that a lot? I'll be going there. Please. Gentlemen, care for a drink? Yes, I'd like some dino DNA. It's not on the menu. Penicillin was not on any menu either. Alexander Fleming went and found it in a petri dish, nonetheless. They'll taste even better with the dip. Mm, delish. Stupid, sturdy piece of German engineering. Mm -hmm. Bag 
Nabbit, I'm too clumsy. I guess I'm stuck here without a key. Druggle Jug. Is that your name? Druggle Jug. Am I not allowed in there? Druggle Jug. But I need to be granted an audience with the king. Druggle Jug. Too bad. <sighs> what a guy. If only I could impress him somehow. For change. Wow, wow, wow! Look what's in there! Look! Empty. A payphone! Finally! I can call my lawyer. If only I could remember his number. Eh, uh, doesn't matter. It's broken anyway. The receiver's missing. Look, Harvey, uh. Yes, yes, a payphone! You don't have to show me absolutely everything. I have eyes too, you know. You do, but they're only sewn on. Hey, Alu! Hello, Edna. What brings you here this time? Can I have the coat hanger? Normally, I despise the concept of material possessions, but the coat hanger is essential to me, I'm afraid. For one thing, it is my aerial that connects me to the ethereal realm. I'm also keeping it handy just in case. An aluminum suit is very prone to wrinkling, you know. I have to get a move on. Take care of your karma. Hold on a second. Yes? Do you want anything in particular? Not really important. Go on with your phone call. I was planning to do that anyway. Hello? You still there? Professor. Attack of the Pterosaurs! No, oh, it's just you. Hello, Edna. Can I borrow your ticket for the laundry lift? Don't be preposterous. I can't do that. I've got to get to my Peruvian amber mines to recover dino DNA. That's too bad. How's research coming along? Uh, quite satisfactorily. The only things missing are a couple of dino genes for my secret breeding program, if you get my drift. That sounds exciting. How does one breed dinos? Oh, do come on. Everybody knows that. Ah, dinosaurs hatch from occlusions in amber. I'll drop by again later. 
If the world still exists, then, is what you mean to say. Yeah, give or take ten minutes. <laughs> no, thank you. I prefer... here and agonizing makes me part of the artistic experience. This is where the barkeeper mixes his drinks? I'd better not carry any of this around. It's likely to melt my whole inventory. And in the end, it might eat through the bios. And we wouldn't want that now, would we? not drink this. I have this terrible heartburn and... Coward! Adna? <sighs> Phew, I was starting to worry. A broken foosball table. Now I see why the loonies think this is a bar. Cut that out, please. I need the darkness, so I don't have to see the world around me. It depresses me. No, the end of the chair leg is frayed enough. Barkeep, one drink, please. I'll be with you in a minute. I'm still serving this gentleman here. But he already has a drink. Don't tell me my job. I've got something for you. This will get you back on your feet in no time. I doubt that. Barkeep, one drink, please. Of course, my dear. What will it be? A coffee, please. It's not on the menu. Of course it is. Bright and clear. What? Let me see. We have a little joker here. That's not my handwriting. You've written that yourself. Admit it. Barkeep? 
One drink, please. Of course, my dear. What will it be? One Edna surprise, please. It's not on the menu. Of course it is. Bright and clear. What? Let me see. We have a little joker. That's not... You've written that... Barkeep, one drink. Of course. One walk... It's not... Of course. What? We have a little joke. That's... You've written... A broken foos... No. Barkeep? Of course. A coffee, please. It's not on the menu. Of course it is. Bright and clear. What? Let me see. We have a little joke. That's... You've written... Ooh, this is so 80s. Barkeep? Of... A grog, please. We don't serve that anymore. What happened? Funny story. There was this guy who found out the stuff eats through metal. He used it to melt the bars of the railings out front. Sounds like he was quite the daring adventurer. Yeah, kind of a nice guy. Of course, he was completely nuts like everybody else in here. Wanted to become a pirate or something. Too bad about him. Why? Did he escape? I'm afraid not. Dr. Marcel broke both his shins. Then he locked him up in a cell where he starved miserably. Oh. Barkeep? Of course, my dear. A glass of water, please. It's not on the menu. Of course it is. Br what? Let me. We have a little. That's not. You've written that yourself. Barkeep? Of course. A biggity buggity boo, please. It's not on the. Of course. What? We have a. That's. You've written. Barkeep? One drink. Of course. Nothing. I'm not thirsty at the moment. Can you add something to the menu for me? That's not the way things work around here, honey. You either order something that's on the menu, or you find yourself another bar. Maker, aren't I? How happy they look! Like to beat the pot. This is something that an. I think Alfred liked to do that. That's fitting. The pot holders go perfectly with this pot. If only it were hot. So now what? Heat up the pot? Yeah. Isn't that the way it has to go?
There's no time to rest now. Ooh, this. A broken foosball table. Now I see why the. If you want to move foosball tables, you should play against meta games. I'm not drunk enough to start a bar brawl now. The day is young. Why? I don't want to open an internet cafe. Hey, don't touch that. That's the only spoon I could find in the whole house. This is where the bar... Hey, don't... That's the only spoon. I'd rather not. I'd rather not. This is a regular coffee cup. The other is a coffee cup for programmers. I'd better not carry any of this or it's likely and in the end. Those are not spirits. Those are detergents. Well, I guess most of them contain a fair amount of alcohol anyway. I simply hate board games, and this... Certainly not! It's alright that people think I'm crazy, but these games are for complete morons! 